John Dorsey made his first picks as Browns GM Mary Kay. They are Baker Mayfield at number one and Denzel Ward at number four. These were not the safest picks. This was not the route many people thought he would choose. Uh, John Dorsey kind of saying to everyone, hey, trust me on this. I've done this before. Trust my track record. Well, I think he was bold and aggressive. He put his own stamp on this draft. And like you said, these weren't the safest picks. But is that where they're setting the bar at safe? Yeah. You know, I think that he wanted to go out and grab the gusto, and they felt as though they really got the best quarterback in this draft. They have loved this guy since the fall. He has studied him. Scott McLuhan has. The coaches came to really like him. And I think that they are counting on him being really really almost like a Brett Favre. Yeah, that, that's certainly what they're hoping, and you know, maybe a Drew Brees type of quarterback as well, something like that. Uh, obviously, Brees a guy that has succeeded at a, at a shorter height, which is what Mayfield is going to have to do. And with Denzel Ward, there was a pass rusher there at number four in Bradley Chubb, maybe the best pass rusher in the draft. A lot of people thought maybe that's the route they would go, but John Dorsey said they needed shutdown cornerbacks. It was something that Greg Williams wanted. It was clear they wanted to upgrade that position all offseason, so they go with Ward. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to uh, watch and see how Bradley Chubb does over the years. It will also be very interesting to see how these other quarterbacks do because this was a choice. They had, you know, four or five quarterbacks to choose from. They went with Baker Mayfield. They surprised everyone in the league. Here's a statistic for you, Dan. Only two quarterbacks have been drafted in the first round under 6-1 in the NFL over the last 15 years. Name them. Well, I know one because he was here. It was Johnny Manziel. I, I don't know about the other. Baker Mayfield. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Oh, I didn't realize we were counting this year. All right, so Baker Mayfield. Yeah, I mean, look, the Mayfield pick is a gamble. Yes. Uh, but it is a gamble that could pay off big because, as they said over and over again, Baker Mayfield was the best quarterback in college football. Mm -hmm. He's accurate. Uh, he's got a good arm. He can play from the pocket. At least he could in college. So maybe this pays off big for the Browns. You know, it might. And it might not. I mean, I, I actually talked to Trent Dilfer, and he said, out of all these guys in this class, he, think, he thinks that uh, Baker Mayfield potentially has uh, the biggest bust factor to him. But he also said if they work it right, put him in the right offense, he can be Drew Brees. So, again, those are the comparisons. Drew B Brees, Russell Wilson, can he be those guys? Well, one thing we learned about John Dorsey – he's going to pick the guys he wants. He's not going to listen to the outside noise. That's what he did today, his first two picks with the Browns. Uh, Friday, the Browns have three picks, at least as of right now, uh, 33, 35, and 64. And John Dorsey likely has more surprises up his sleeve on Friday.